All right. I'm going to teleport you all to me, okay? Now, from my perspective, guys, just everyone stop, hands off the computer and looking at me for a second. Okay, Shannon? Thank you. You guys are all really jam-packed. I'm telling you, you're in a two by two room. So you have two blocks, two blocks, two blocks, two blocks. So there are four blocks for all 12 of you to stand on. Okay? Now, if I said to you, you guys were the particles, what state of the three states of matter that we've talked about do you think you're in? Solid. Why do you say solid? Because you're all together and like cramped. And you can't move very much. You can move a little bit, but not very much. Okay? You're going to have to come back in, I'm sorry. All right, so just come back in quick. Now we've just got to wait for Summer to come back in. So in a solid, guys, the particles, how did you get out? Or are you not out? Oh, you've changed your camera. Okay, that's cool. So, oh, actually, that's a good point. Everyone press F5. Hey, I've taught you that. Yeah, that's fine. Press F5. Move the mouse around a bit. And you can see how closely packed you all are. Whoa. Okay, if you move the mouse around Is a little it? bit, you'll be able to see how tightly packed you all are. So all the particles in a solid, all the particles that make up a solid, okay, are really closely packed together and they can only move a real little bit. You'll notice if you've got your camera set up that people are sort of jiggling around a little bit. Okay? They're not moving a lot, but they're jiggling around a little bit. Aren't they? All right, Summer, so press F5 and you'll be able to see what everyone else is seeing. Okay, move your mouse around a bit. All right. See, they're all moving around a little bit. They're not moving around a lot, though, are you? Now, I'm going to apply some heat. Now, that means that I'm going to turn the wood on fire. So press F5 twice, guys, to get back to seeing it normally. All right. So I've turned up the heat. The wood is on fire. Your computers might run a bit slow while it all burns off. But if you think about... That's fine. If you think about what happens when you were all in that little room, okay, when you were all in that little room, you think, you think about ice, okay? Ice is a solid, isn't it? So all the particles in ice are tightly linked together. They can't move very much. Now I've just lit that area on fire. I've applied some heat, okay? What does that do to the ice? When you, when you put heat to ice, what happens? Melts. It melts. And it becomes what? A liquid. <coughs> All right. So what I've done here... Shh. That's fine. You can get out if you want, guys. How did you get out out? How did you get out out? Oh, I think I might know how you did it. That's all right. I'll teleport you. Teleport you back in if that's all right, Paul. How'd you get out, Paul? Paul here. All right. So stay in the container, guys. So now I've applied the heat. You can see that you are now all a little bit more freely able to move, aren't you? Okay. So what state do you think you're in now? You're in a liquid state now. So press F5. Okay, move the camera around so you can see everyone. All right, so move the camera around so you can see everyone. And what's happened, guys? It doesn't work. F5, not 5. F5. F5, that one. Okay, so press F5 and move the camera around a bit so you can see what's going on. Do you notice that people are able to move a bit more freely around? Yeah. All right, so in a liquid. Lucky. In a liquid, the particles are able to move a bit more, but they're still contained, they're still stuck together, aren't they? Yeah. Okay? Because you guys can't actually get out, theoretically, Paul managed it, but you can't get out of that room. Okay? 
Paul's still trying. Paul's a parkour champion. All right. I'll help you out, Paul. There you go. <laughs> no, I've just stopped that. So, what's going to happen, guys, if I apply more heat to you? What happens when you apply more heat to water, which is liquid? It evaporates and it turns into water vapour or steam, okay, which approximates a gas for as far as we're concerned. So if I burn down the log around you now, what's going to happen? You're going to escape, aren't you? There's going to be nothing holding you in. Okay? And you're all, you're all going to be able to run as far apart as you like. You're not going to be held together to one another. Okay? So get ready to run. Because once you become a gas, guys, there starts our free play. Okay? So I'm going to go around. I'm going to set the, the wall on fire. It's probably going to set the, it's probably going to set the forest on fire. Okay, but once I've done this, guys, and you become a gas particle, you can, you can do whatever you would like in the game. Okay? Can you put it on, Pierre? Can you give us certain stuff? I will give everyone unlimited torches. That is about it, all you need. Can, just can we have a pickaxe as well? You can yeah. make all of that stuff yourself. If you want to learn how to make it or you don't already know, you can ask people in the room. Okay. I know. I know how to make a pickaxe. All right, I've applied some more heat. So, once you become a gas particle, you are free. You're not tied to anyone else, and you can therefore go and do what you would like. I'm free. All right. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Yeah, as I said, it'll start a forest fire. I haven't turned digging on yet. Give it a, give it a couple of minutes. All right. So, what I want you to do, really, guys, is just go for a bit of a run, okay? Britt, you're a bit stuck. We're just waiting for Brittany to become... You can't dig. No, no, you can't dig yet. Just waiting for Brittany to become a gas molecule. You right, Britt? There you go, buddy. All right. I am going to turn on that you guys can build. Okay. If you so you can now build, do whatever you would like. Okay. You cannot die. I am also going to give all of you some torches. So if you want to go exploring in some of the caves, you can. All right. So I've given. Each of you a lot of torches, so you can now do what you would like. 